Are you ready to answer some I'm, questions about the female I'm gonna body? I'm going to do really well. Oh, God. Are you ready? Oh, God. My pulse. You, so, <laughs> why do you look so grossed out? <laughs> you said periods, and I kind of, like, I'm freaking out. Yeah. Okay. Are you Here ready? We go. Ready. Ready? Let's ready? do it. First question. Okay. When a woman does Kegel exercises, what part of the body is she strengthening? The labia. That's on the outside. So you think when she's doing Kegel exercises, you could like see her labia like moving like- I would like to change my answer. Okay. <laughs> I think that's a good idea. Uh, the grip. The, uh, 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 the, the grip of her vagina. Tighten, tighten it up. Tighten it up. The lower region. We're gonna need a less yeah. broad answer. We're gonna need to get way more specific with these. I mean, the technical term would be their hoo-ha. <laughs> <laughs> like strengthening the uh, li ridges, the lips or something? I don't know. <laughs> Doesn't that seem like something you'd want to strengthen though? I mean, you know, you gotta have babies there. You gotta, it takes pounding. I feel like it's the pelvic floor. Oh right? my God, you're oh the first one to get it right. It. You're the only one who's got said pelvic floor. Nobody there got it. Go. There we go. The correct answer is pelvic floor. Your pelvic well, floor. Well, yeah. <laughs> I feel like my, my mind was in the right place. You Maybe were in that. the lower half of the body. Okay. You nailed that. That's, <laughs> that's true. One day I'm gonna look up how you actually even pull that off. Like, how do you do Be that? Be careful what you Google. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> do what you think is a kilo right now. What, what, what did you do? You just went that's, like this. <laughs> no, it's my butt cheeks went in. <laughs> okay. If I could strengthen my penis <laughs> willingly, I would. What exactly is a uterus? What does it do? I've asked this question. Well, you have the uterus tubes. Well, those, well, those are, are the fallopian, fallopian tubes. tubes. Yeah. Okay. That. <laughs> well, the uterine lining, of course, we shed. We. That has to deal with, uh, you know, reproduction, I would think. I mean, most of it does. <laughs> <laughs> uterus. Shit. Uh, so there's. All right. That. That. Shit. I want to say, is that where you pee or is that where, like, the baby? becomes the baby. Those are two very different yes. things. Yes. It's where the sperm goes? Wow. <laughs> Wait, hold you, on. And then what do you think Joe, happens? Hold on. Are there eggs there? You're looking at me. Elizabeth has one too. It's it's, it's a larger thing, isn't it? It's a, it's a big- How big is it? How big, How big do you think it is? I, I don't I don't know. Sam, you okay. gotta answer these questions. I, 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 you look I, great I, to be here. For an adult woman. For me, how big do you think my uterus is? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you have, and I wouldn't <laughs> dare to ask. The egg comes down the fallopian tubes and sits in the uterus, and it's where the baby grows. Good job. Baby grows. Isn't that where the baby develops, right? Yes. Very good, Bob. <sighs> but you're not growing a baby. So what's happening now? I hope now? not. <laughs> I mean, what's going on down there? Nothing. It's gonna. Okay. Well, it's then gonna, it's nothing. It's I a barren, barren wasteland. Okay. It's going it's to. It's not a wasteland. Well, we it's have, a wasteland. I mean, one it's day, a waste maybe. Shows <laughs> right now. Where does a woman pee from? Yes, I know this one. If you had a vagina, where would you pee from? My vagina. That is incorrect. This is not a trick question. There's a specific term for it, but it's above the vagina. The urinary tube, I think. <laughs> urethra, right? That's, am I saying that right? Yeah. yeah. I'm saying that right? It, it is the urethra. Yes. Yeah. Well, the urethra, there's the oh vagina. Oh my God, you're nailing it. There's the it. vagina, and then there's the urethra. It's separate from the vagina, people. I thought I had a urethra. You do. Well, what the hell? <laughs> Next question. What does PMS stand for? Oh, <laughs> it deals with the periods. Yes. I know that. Very um, good, Sam. Something menstruations. Prenatal fucking marital. PMS shit, I don't know. It's it's definitely a shit show. Something to do with menstruation. Yeah. What are the other letters? Fuck. Post menstruation. Stuff. <laughs> Pubic. 
<laughs> menstruation syndrome? You got two words. Two out of three, but the first was the most disturbing. So Private? Pachina? <laughs> Keep saying keywords because it's great. <laughs> Pussy. Oh, no. <laughs> no, oh, don't take, cut that, cut so that. Pan American. <laughs> Parallelogram. <laughs> the answer is it's code for. Fucking duck your head, shut the fuck up, and run if at all possible. There's no solutions to be made. You're wrong. Things are gonna suck for a little while. It doesn't matter what it stands for. We all know what it is. That's it. That was definitely a married man's answer. What an answer. <laughs> the S is syndrome. Good job. Work your way backwards. The P is pre... Oh. Uh, pre, is it premenstrual? You did it! You got it right, you're the first guy to get it right. It's pre, it's very, oh, very strange. I knew that, pre-menstruation syndrome. Every time we say it, they're like, oh, I knew that. Uh -oh. Are you ready for the, the finale? Final, the final test? Show us how to use this tampon. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Is it open? <laughs> no. <laughs> I have to open? You're doing great so far. <laughs> I have to open. Show us open. how to use a tampon. Okay. Wait, before you do, what does the R stand for? That's, R stands for rectum because that's the end you put in your butt. <laughs> well, I hope it's not recycled. Um, Cause that'd be weird, huh? What does the R stand for? Right. I I'm guessing it's vagina size or something. <laughs> and it's yeah, width said. of vagina, no. I'm guessing. No, Wh then what the fuck would R stand for? Oh, is it uh, regular? Yes, that is correct. Regular. That's good. You know this guy has a girlfriend, hey. look at him. <laughs> Wait, what are the other letters and what do they stand for? How many letters are there? There's three. Okay. Without so it's regular, super size, extra crispy, <laughs> original recipe, and diet Sprite. Finger licking. Now, <laughs> oh God. That was a mistake. No, it's R is for regular. Regular, R is for as regular. in regular vagina. No. And then W no, is like wide set. it's not regular vagina. <laughs> it's regular for flow. So you have a regular- Oh, if you have a regular flow. So the other letters are L and H. Light flow, heavy. Yes, yes, oh, there we go. Oh, wow. Regular flow, you heavy flow, You learn something new every day. Interesting, so you open it, obviously. <laughs> you pull this out. All right, this is very clear to me. Okay. Um, honestly, good. I've never touched this before. <laughs> yeah, Aw, oh, first time for everything. So, okay, all right. Somehow, Somehow. you insert <laughs> this manually up the uh, hole. This is the part you put in your butthole. <laughs> yes. Um, Show us how to do it. Well, you know. You push it in the vagina thing there. This will be a Just vagina. Just do it. Right, yeah. So it's gonna go in there. Okay. This is a vagina. Okay. Put That's a in. vagina. Yeah. Yes. We have to make sure it's uh, I'll show you what, like, ready actually. for, you have to, He's, you think you have to lube up your vagina before you put a tampon in? Oh, oh my would, God. Can you please? just, you gotta get it loose down there. So in this scenario, she's already, you know, she's, she's bleeding. Like, she's you're, like, you're literally bleeding. Oh, so she's loose. Are you like, she's, what is it? What is it? What she, you just gotta get like, them loose. What? I have so many questions. I'll stop doing it. Okay. Now, can you bring the vagina? <laughs> okay, so you stick it in. Uh huh. Then you do a Kegel. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Wait, maybe the Kegel exercises do something where it like, you know, springs open or something. And then uh, somehow this has to come <laughs> out, I would think, right? He's pulling it so hard. He's not even yanking out. And then I don't know, is there a, a release? Sam tried to pull it down too. Is it like one of those things Do like it. a firecracker where it like pops or something? That'd be fucking awesome. That should have worked. Why do they all try to pull it? You just rev it up like a lawnmower. <laughs> <laughs> is it turn? I don't know. How does you it work? It. Maybe you push it in first. Oh yes, first there you push you it in. Oh, oh, so you would do this. Oh, I, I kept there. pulling it. Oh, you push. And then it comes out. Like a push pop. <laughs> and, then, and then, oh, we pull this down, okay, boom. Yeah, there, there you go. go. I thought this stayed in. You thought the plastic part stayed inside? I don't know. I walking around with plastic in their vaginas all day? Seemed uncomfortable. Women are fucking complicated, <laughs> I don't know. Mm -hmm. And then you throw this away, or maybe you... That's an applicator, yes. You Can should... you recycle this? You should. I mean, no. it, if it's covered in period blood, do you think that's a good idea? Well, maybe you rinse it first. What? Can you recycle it? No. No. Okay. I didn't think we'd be talking about recycling so much on this sex ed episode. There you go, and now you can't get pregnant. <laughs> well, you leave that that's in. not Fun fact. This just sits in there. And it, it absorbs. And then it expands. Wow, never seen it it's do that. beautiful. Never seen it do that. <laughs> 
it looks like lungs. Like, yeah, <laughs> like, it is like lungs. It like, right? And then when you're done, you... Okay. It. And then you throw it away and pray to God for forgiveness. <laughs> <laughs> and that's science. Get it away from me. Joe. Why? <laughs> Why is that scary to you? I was close. You you taught yourself. You actually did the best out of everybody. You, you got did four out of five so right. well. I think sometimes knowing less is more. Yeah. Well, this has been this good. good. Yeah. Man, thanks for opening up with me, you guys. You're welcome. Anytime. <laughs>